Hello everybody, welcome back to another video. Today, I'm going to be doing a revised version of Scroll and Walk Your Solves. So the last two, in my opinion, were pretty bad. Uh, the first one that I did was when I averaged about 15. Didn't know a lot about square one. And the second one I did, I didn't even know CSP. Or maybe I did, but uh, my solves are a bit incoherent. So today, I'm going to be doing another Scroll and Walkthrough Solve video. Hopefully this one's shorter, more concise, and you can learn a bunch from it. Here we go. So for the first solve, we have 4, 1, 1 pair. Uh, I went ahead and already traced this. I'm not going to go through tracing uh, just because it's kind of easy and take us, takes up a lot of time. Uh, but basically, I got odd. So for the odd algorithm, I'm going to move both over, doing kind of like a U, uh, D prime kind of. And what I do is I'll preserve this pawn on the left side of the slice and preserve this pair on the left side of the slice as well. So when I slice down, I now have two uh, pawns, and I can do uh, U prime and then solve them, just like that. Now I can pair up OBL. So for this, I'm going to pair up these two corners to make a block, and then do a D2 and pair up the rest. I uh, now I'm just left with one one, so I can do U D2, solve one one, and now I'm going to have uh, I and so I know this top PBL. This is a W in the bottom. I'm not exactly sure, but I know that I have two blocks here, so I do a J prime algorithm. I'm going to get adjacent on the bottom, W on the top with a bar flip. I can go straight into this algorithm, and I'll have a UF. Okay, so for this case, we have 3, 2, 1, L. Uh, so at the start of inspection, I did a Y2, because I traced from this piece, and I got odd, which is the better alg. So for odd, we can do a couple things. We can do U prime, D prime, and then one slice, uh, which gives us shield square. Or we can also solve it with... Uh, shield on the bottom by doing like a U D and then one slice so I chose to solve it on the top so we can just do U prime D prime slice shield square uh, from here I have one corner on the top so I'll pair it up with another corner on the bottom and then I'll do a D2 and pair up the last block now I'm left with LL so I'll just do this OBL and I see on the bottom that CP is solved I'll get an edge in the top and from this edge uh, on the top, we can just do a J perm, and I get op op. So I have opposite on top, opposite on bottom. And to solve this, if they're both on the sides, I actually learned this trick from Tucker Chamberlain, so shout out to him. If you do one, move both layers, M2, move both layers back, slice, and then it's a UF. Okay, so for the third scramble, we have shield square, which I was kind of surprised when I first got this. Um, and I traced it, and it's actually even. So for CSP, even is the good alg, so you're most familiar with this one. Uh, for this, I just aligned both layers like that and then turned it into similar fist, solved it, and then got CO. So for CO, you can really do this however you want, but I did a U on the top, D2 on the bottom, and then did slice, D prime, slice, D slice. Oh, sorry, I, I'm aligned before I did the last slice. And then I had one, one. Noticing that I was going to get an adjacent case in the bottom, which would be an A perm and a U perm on the top. Uh, so what I can do here is keep the U perm the same. Uh, do a D2 and a misalignment, JJ, and then I'll be left with another JJ. It's all PBL. Okay, so for the first one, fourth one, we got um, right fist uh, shield. So for this one, I got even. I'm going to just do a U on top, slice, negative one, slice. Then I'll do a D, and now I'm left with a similar pawn in the back. So I'll solve that. That'll give me CO. So for CO, I can do U2, D. It's one slice, and then we have um, LL for EO. We'll solve that. And now we're left with uh, T perm, F perm. So for this, I'll, if I misalign both layers, I actually get similar U perms. If I do JJ, now I have similar U perms with a bar flip. Okay, so for this we have uh, scalp on the top and barrel on the bottom, and we actually got odd. So for this one, I'm just going to do a D prime, slice, and then U prime. And now I can do one more slice, and we're left with barrel, barrel. Or I guess how you can think about it is just shield, shield in the back. You can solve that. And now I see that we have diagonal on top for CO and line on the bottom. So we'll just do a one, solve it like that, U prime D. And then we can do 1, 1. I notice there's a block on top, which will be an A perm, and on bottom we have a V perm. Uh, so for this case, we can just do JN like this, preserving this block, and getting uh, two U perms. 
Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you learned something from these walkthrough solves. I did some more fancy stuff than I did last time. I incorporated some PBL, um, more CSP stuff, obviously. So hopefully this helped people. If you do want a more in-depth tutorial on how I find uh, tracing, I could go through uh, like 20 scrambles and just show my tracing orientation for each case or how I would solve the CSP case. Um, that could be in a separate video, so let me know if you want to see that. And thank you guys for watching. Bye.